Hello everybody! Welcome back to Shantae and the Pirate's Curse. Last time, we had a... We had a run-in with, uh... Squid Baron as the new boss of, uh... Tanline Isles. As well as got a new map to visit the next location available. Remember the town was first built. Go to town, you see the blah blah blah, yada yada. I don't have enough lobster tails. Well, we definitely haven't set out yet on the new adventure. Uh. I'm not sure if I said this yet, but, um, between episodes, I looked up some info regarding the mayor and or, uh, Branson's sword. That info being, uh, two particular things. A, that... I'm technically not able to get Branson's sword yet. Apparently what's required is Risky's Boots. Which I imagine we might get in this next one. Uh, this next land. That being said though, uh, the mayor and his requests for food don't actually have any harbinger on story or any special event in particular. They're more so just for uh, money. Which means I can eat these meat chocolates. Now, something I did notice, which might be a bit late or early, who knows, is that, um,. I neglected something at least a couple episodes ago, and I am here to rectify that to be to start off with. Now I bet you're wondering what I missed. Well, if you were as keen I as keen die as I was, mind you, I was editing it, and I noticed that some things you just can't catch while you're focused on the mission at hand. I missed the heart squid in Tanline Kingdom. I probably missed a lot more, honestly. But, uh... Since we're freely able to go throughout this... place, you can see that there's three areas missing in this large... uh... Honestly, fucking maze. I'll, I'll say exactly what it is, it's a maze. We can see up there, there's a little guy that's been uh, eluding us. That being said though, we don't have a particular way of getting to him. Oh, okay, okay. Magic. Oh jeez, alright, so... Looks like we're just gonna have to go with trial and error. That or look for a place we went through. It's it's hard for reference, I'm not gonna lie. Because this truly is just a maze to us. I remember being in here. It's getting us someplace else, but uh, let's just go up here then. So we can find another path. Honestly, I think we're just going to be stuck looking around until we find the right thing. We don't have to worry about hiding anymore, so that's the good thing. Well, we can probably steal the riches ten times over again. 
So we're definitely going to get a lot out of this visit. Heck, we might even be able to buy some more things that we need. Uh, where are we? There's not a way left. We haven't gotten in there yet. Would be clever. Definitely going in yellow. Oh. Despite the fact that this guy's looking left. Hey, all right, here we go. What an interesting what set of corridors, but uh. For sake of sanity, preferably everyone else's, I'll be sure to mark down or give some sort of editor's note to what this was. Is it a lot of rats? Sorry, rat. Oh, here's where we would have seen that they're holding, or uh, they're holding. One of our friends hostage. Or we would have. Fortunately, I already uh, done enough kicking a butt. Being said, I'm also curious. Let's go check on what's going on over here. Behold! Our princess has returned. Shut your yap. That's it. That's all we get. Oh. Well. Chanta ain't having none of it. I'm pretty sure that's all that's left. <laughs> that being said, I am totally ready for uh, me to have to come back for a third time, undoubtedly. Or even a fourth. I imagine if it, um, if it's just the third time, I'll just be getting uh, Branson's sword and then whatever else I'm missing. Besides that, we have a whole new place to visit. I really, well, you know what? I have money now, so I could invest in some more items that's needed. I didn't rob them blind like last time, but at the same time, we're also getting items to where we can kind of negate the need to purchase some stuff. I can really appreciate the fact that you can just juggle them. Alright. Let's just mosey on over. Ready to shove off? Yep. Let's just quickly head on over back to... Scuttle Town. Just... I want to see... We actually have to come back here. Last time we also got a fossil face. Bolo, can you do anything with this fossil? You gave fossil. No, according to your uncle, I'm near side. And that's why I broke his glass capsule uh, and let whatever escape. Because I'm clumsy and, forget and a forgetful oaf. You're welcome to try these glasses on. You gave extra specs. Wow, I can't see any better, but I feel super smart. Let me see that fossil. It's a ritual death mask, approximately 1,500 years old. It's been heavily, uh, petrized and contains high levels of sulfur. I've removed most of the sediment, but, uh, 
but left a bit of, of matrix for stability. Still not something you should wear on your face. There you go. You got the death mask. Wow, Bolo, that was amazing. It was nothing. It was nothing, really. That death mask certainly gives up an unusual aura. It's as though it exists in a world apart from our own. Thank you, Gramps. How was that Bolo's fault? We're the one now, whatever. You ready to shove off? Alright then, let's do it. Risky, we're off to Mudbog Island. I can officially state we're beyond territory that I am uh, well versed in. Land ho! Welcome to Mudbog Island. It smells kind of bad. We got. We've cut off three fifths of the Pirate Master's power. He's sure to have noticed by now. Even from the grave, he'll attempt to impede on our progress somehow. But enough of that. We have something more to discuss. Oh? I think we figured out the I think I figured out the origin of dark magic. How? Process of elimination. When the genies defeated the pirate master, they had to drain themselves completely to get the job done. They've reduced him to mere ash and bone. Without magic to sustain them, the genies faded from this world. No more genies with their light magic, no more pirate master with his dark magic. Just you. Me? When I borrowed your magic to suit my purposes, I made a wish, remember? You took over you took over my magic half and used it for evil. So you turned it into dark magic. That's right. But I destroyed it after that. Perhaps, perhaps not. It's more likely that you scattered the magic. Why would you say that? Because magic can never truly be destroyed, can it? I don't know. Not long after that encounter with uh, after that encounter, the curse placed upon my men began to take effect, indicating that a new source of dark magic had been found. Gasp! Whatever the magic's origin, we can worry about it later. You got another den of evil to find. Uh, could this be true? Pirate Master's using my magic? Damn right. Let's go, Shante. Mudbog Island. Oh, look at that little guy. He's my little bit. Alright, gotta die. Uh, this is the place. Full of speeders. Mono eyed speeders. And plenty of things that can shoot projectiles at us. Oh god, and a disgusting gob of mass. That looks particular. We have gob monster. And gob of mass it looks particularly uh voluptuous. At least that's what I think. They also spot up out of nowhere, what it looks like. Oh, it's these guys that were shooting those. The good thing is they gave off a lot of uh, money. Oh, and that guy responded. Oh, let's just climb through a carapace. Yeah, okay. Thank God I'm hurting more than these guys are, but still. Correction. Thank God I'm causing more pain than these guys are. Shanti's very resilient for just half human. Alright, I was wondering like if spikes on top hurt. It'd be kind of nice to have a visual representation that they're being hurt, like, you know, they lose more and more of their, uh, form. That'd, that'd be cute, at least, but, uh, oh, jeez. I mean, they are, but, you know, it doesn't feel like I'm doing much. Why do they have such curves? 
I don't understand. Why is why is the grape jelly busty? Being a little bit more cautious than normal, but at the same time, uh, this is definitely foreign place to me. You got a flesh pop. Of course they dropped those. I don't think we can get up there. Oh, but we shows that there's something up there, though. I keep forgetting pressing down on on these on some of these uh, panels can uh, cause the one to go through them. No, no, we're not getting up there without some boosting us up. Let's try this out. Whoa, almost got a uh, double team. But, nope, I can't even get there. Oh god. I am way too hasty for this level. So much so, I'm literally about to get shot in the face. Why is the grape jelly busty? I don't understand. Oh, there was a bucket. Horde of bats that look oddly like Shanti. These monsters ain't even paying out as well as they should. Okay. What? Who are you? Uh. I am Hector. Hexer. Beyond this gate. <laughs> the village of Lost Souls. Lost Souls? It's a place. <laughs> Separate from those who are living and those who have moved on. <laughs> you may not enter this place. What's this? I detect something strange within you. Just be yourself. As I thought, ones one such as you cannot can never enter here. Skip all that oh come on. She's special. Uh, all right. S s stop! I sense something new. <laughs> I did not talk before. You suffered much in life, then caused the suffering of others as well. <laughs> Your burden is heavy indeed. I sound awful. You may enter the village of Lossels. You will forget your suffering and misdeeds, <laughs> and remain here for all time. Uh, I got any rage check on that dog. On a separate note, what a gnarly looking entrance. Village of Lost Souls. I have an odd feeling everything's hostile. Dang. Uh, there's gotta be a way in there. Hold on, little squiddy. With a shot. Nope, oh, you're stuck, little squiddy. Sorry, bud. Of course, there's ghosts. I hate these guys. And getting up there. 
Just like I can float safely down and see what's going on. We have Lemios here. Lemios. Whatever. Yeah, they gave us bento boxes. Not all bad. Hey, Grabs. These look like actual people. Yeah, they're not attacking me. My blue coin, where is it? I must keep searching for my green coin, even if it takes forever. I need my red coin. You must have it. Uh, you look familiar. Welcome, friend. This is the village of Lost Souls. What's your name? You look familiar somehow. Hmm, I have no idea who I am. But thank you ever so much for asking. Oh god, oh my gosh, you're... That's, uh, that is... How did you come to be in this village, friend? Huh, I don't know. Nobody knows how they got here. We're all just here. All I know is I'm alone. That's so sad. I'm only truly happy when I'm asleep. When I sleep, it's like I'm transported to another world where I'm with my family. When I wake up, I can't remember, I can't remember them anymore. Only I could remember. She needs help. Seriously. This sounds like... Serious. Mm hmm. I got things to look out for. As always... Oh, jeez, Reapers! I ain't playing with that. Oh, that's nice. Alright, they, they can be stun locked. And they come right back. Alright. That was worthwhile. Oh, jeez. Dragons. Oh, God. I can't take... No. Oh. I know I have two auto potions, but I prefer just not to die in general. Oh, it says. Hmm, looks like there'd be a fire here. Can I light something? You got the green coin! Well, we got that one guy's thing. Do we have. Nah, I don't think we have anything. That's not like. Oh, we already helped one of them out. Let's see what we can do about the other things. We still need to. Who's at the door? You smell pretty and sweet. Don't you know it's the absolute or of suffering? The deepest and darkest place of the village of lost souls. This is for stinky nerd dwells only. Get lost. Okay. We have Nehru's pendant. Sorry, Nehru's uh coin. Someone had to make the joke eventually. Somehow she's in range to be shooting at me. Well, we have blocks here we can't actually destroy. Bop, bop, bop. They got lots of tail. Oh! That was an accident. I thought there was another way to get in. We also... Oh, jeez. They hurt so much. Yeah, it's like a bento box, so I can't complain. What did you do? 
What do you do? Ah, oh, I think I know. Oh, wait. Here we go. Oh, too far. You take a lot of hits. You should get bento boxes. I'm not too upset. <laughs> Alright then, so what do you do? Like, I know you do something, I just don't know what yet. Ah! That's what you do. I can't shoot you in any way. And I can just barely reach that. Oh, onward we go. Stupid the ghosts. They are the most annoying. Like they're like they're not even that bad. It's just that they pop out of nowhere. That's what irritates me. Oh dear, I'm gonna have a field day with this, aren't I? Okay, the one thing I expected there to be something there. Hey, grab. You know what, actually, perfect timing. Uh, stop this here and uh, continue this on the next episode. Next time on Shantae and the Pirates Curse, we're going to see about getting that last coin and figuring out what the heck's going on on this island. For lack of a better outro, I'll see you guys then. Later.